We begin with breaking news out of Pierce County tonight where a man was shot and killed on a street in Parkland. Let's get right to King 5's Jim Nelson live on the scene on Pacific Avenue near 118th Street. Jim. Yeah, Greg, we just found out that the victim's girlfriend is the key witness. In fact, right now, the only known witness. The Pierce County Sheriff's Department has already had a chance to talk to her, but at this point, any information on the suspect is still very limited. I want to show you some video from earlier in the night taken from across the street. We got a pretty clear look at a gun that was found lying in the street, a number of live and spent casings nearby. It was around 640 when deputies received responded. The victim was found lying on Pacific Avenue between 118th and 119th streets here in Parkland, just a few feet in front of a bus stop. Let's come back out now live to our video. The medical examiner's office is still on scene here processing the crime scene. As soon as they clear out of here, I'm told that investigators with the Pierce County Sheriff's Department will then be able to go in and finish their part of the initial investigation. Now, I mentioned the victim's girlfriend. A spokesperson said she was here when this happened and told deputies the suspect took off in a vehicle, but there's no description beyond that. Unfortunately, there was another situation here. Sergeant Darren Moss said another family member of the victim was arrested for assaulting an officer after trying to get past the crime tape. So as much as people want to go and maybe comfort their loved one or go see them again, we need them to stay out of the area because Ultimately, we want a clean case that we can investigate and get our suspects and say no one else touched this. So obviously emotions running high. We did want to provide that context for you as that part of the story uh, continues to unfold and develop. But again, uh, the story here in Parkland is that one man is dead, uh, shot to death. The suspect still on the run. Live in Pierce County, Jim Nelson, King 5 News.